welcome to jasonnewland.com My name is Jason and this is your daily hypnosis session. I hope you're well and I hope that you can take the next few minutes out of your day to relax, let go of any stresses or strains or issues in your life and just focus on my words, my voice and I suggest that you get yourself comfortable, sit in a comfortable chair or lying down, close your eyes if it's safe for you to do so and just let you know there may be background sounds which is fine makes no difference because my voice will be what you'll focus on and also whatever it is we discuss you'll also be focusing on that focusing on how you physically feel emotional feelings and I thought today it would be nice to just think about some things that may be getting in the way of your own pleasure. Things that might get in the way of you enjoying your life. And I know that for some people it can be issues or grudges that you might hold or maybe someone that has annoyed you or upset you in some way. Whether it be today or last week or even 20 years ago, whatever. And I thought it would be quite interesting and maybe a bit of fun to focus on maybe letting go of some of those feelings and changing, fine tuning your mind so that you see things differently, so that you experience things differently so when you think about that thing which occurred that incident that it no longer brings up the same feelings that it did before when it was an issue and now it's not that as important as it was it's kind of lost its energy if that makes any sense and there's so many different ways that you can do this um, the limitation is only your own limitations of imagination there really is so many different ways so what I'd like you to do this is just one of many ways which you can change how you feel about that person is I'd like you to think of somebody when you think about them normally you get a feeling of whatever it is for you I'm just gonna my word would be maybe negativity but you might have a different word it could be anger it could be frustration it could be disgust it could be yeah it could be a stronger word than that that might make you laugh if you think about some of the strong words you might have which of course I'm not going to say during the session, but whatever the word is, it's fine, it's okay. I just like you to imagine 0 to 10 on the score, 0 being that you really get no feelings about them at all, that it's it doesn't bother you, they don't bother you at all. 10, when you think about them, 10 being the most, you know, like it's the most extreme feelings that you could ever get. And before we go any further, I'd like you to think about somebody that annoys you or upsets you, but don't think about anybody that's hurt you really badly or anything like that right now. This isn't a time for any trauma or anything like that. This, this is more for somebody that may just be annoying. 
maybe someone that uh, hasn't necessarily hurt you but gets on your nerves or you know winds you up or something like that does that make sense because it's only a short session I don't want to go in I don't want you to get think about something really big and then then I'm gone and leaving you with that so just think about somebody that mildly annoys you or an incident that wound you up so just notice what number you are from 0 to 10 as you think about that person right now and I just want you to remember the number whether it's a 4 or a 5 or a 6 just remember the number and we'll go back and do that again in a minute so all I want you to do is just imagine that person okay and just imagine them see them on their own seeing their face their body And then just imagine that out of your hand, you're sending freezing cold air towards them. Freezing cold air out of your hand. Either your right or left hand, it doesn't matter. Straight at them, freezing them turning them completely to ice completely to ice with one hand and just look at them and notice that you can see right through them you can see right the way through them because they're made of ice You can see all the way through. And how can ice have any emotional effect on you at all, really? And now you can do this with the same hand or with the other hand. Just put your hand out on your mind and I want you to s just send heat like from the sun shining out of your hand sending a hot heat directly at that person and just watch what happens to them as the heat goes against that ice the ice that you can see through starts to melt melting quickly because that heat is so hot and just watch as that ice turns into a puddle and that puddle turns and evaporates into air into nothingness And now I'd like you to think back to that chart, that 0 to 10. And what number is it now from 0 to 10? And notice how it's changed from before. I hope this was worthwhile for you and useful. And this is something that you can do yourself um, on your own. Or you can just re-listen to this or re-watch this video. Thank you very much and enjoy the rest of the day. Feeling wonderful.